When I was in college at New York University, I needed a job and I knew that I wanted to work someplace that appealed to my sensibilities. And I figured I would work at like a bookstore, a record store, and I ended up at Inkiru Books, which was in the neighborhood I grew up in, Park Slope, Brooklyn. When I got to Inkiru, they were skeptical about hiring me. They hired me and fired me a couple times, not because I did anything wrong, but just because it was just tough to keep someone on staff. It was the job that defined my late teenage, early adult years. I was known as the guy who worked at the bookstore. I was there seven days a week, and I spent all my time there, and it was a great experience because I got to meet people from all walks of the community. And then the bookstore would have uh, author signings. Anybody black who wrote a book in that time, I got to meet them at the store. My career started there. Most deaf started coming out, hanging out there. A lot of artists from Deb Prez to Shabam Sadiq and all these artists I started making music with. You know, just to see a black owned business that was concerned about the community had a huge impact on me. And when the store started really failing was around the time my career started taking off. So most Def and I uh, parlayed a lot of our money and our the first earnings we had into trying to save the bookstore. Uh, we ended up not being able to. And so it would be great to sort of reignite that legacy if I ever get the chance. And that's something that I'm, I'm looking forward to. Hey yo, it's Talib Kweli. Subscribe to Thinker right now. Peace. The New Jim Crow makes the argument that our criminal justice system, especially the war on drugs component of it, has become a new system of racial caste subordination that operates very much like the old system of Jim Crow. Well, it's called the New Jim Crow because slavery is something that powered the South. And when that ended, they struggled to quickly find ways to maintain that system, but do it in a legal way. And the Jim Crow system was the best thing they came up with. It was a way to get people to still be indentured servants.